I'm Bree. And I'm Rachel. And we lead a young adult women's uh, journey group here at Journey Bible Church. Yeah. The Lord has taught me a lot through leading this group. I think one thing that both of us has le have learned is just um, surrendering, surrendering our plans in the way that I think that this group should run and the way that I think um, God can work best. Yeah, I think um, the Lord has truly taught me just that every Bible study or journey group does not have to look exactly the same either. We meet in a townhome, um, which is not a lot of space, three bedrooms and one main floor. and. I um, was really apprehensive of inviting 16 girls into our space, but I think the Lord has really learned, taught us that um, space will be space. We just have to open it up and invite girls in. And um, we pack the house. We are on the top floor to the bottom floor, and we have girls everywhere. So I think that I've just learned a big lesson on surrender and how if I am just obedient to the Lord and what He's calling us to do, um, people will come and the space will um, the space will be there. Um, we have actually changed the format of how our group looks like um, on a Tuesday night. Um, like she said, because we have a smaller space, a tiny little townhome. Um, so my group meets in my bedroom on my bed and I just open up my space that is very personal um, and vulnerable to me. Um, but the Lord meets us there in that bedroom in Olathe in a townhome. For those of you who are on the fence about joining the journey group, one thing I think about is um, how in James it talks about we'll meet trials of various kinds and we never know when those trials will come into our life. I think about this within this last year, my mom was diagnosed with cancer and luckily I'd been walking alongside a lot of um, fellow believers and I was in a journey group already and helping lead it and so when I found out that news, I ran right to my journey group girls and I just, um, I'm so blessed that I was able to walk through this journey, this last couple seasons with them, with girls that know who I am and know the truth that I need to hear and know um, what encouragement I need when I'm getting bad news or girls that are there to celebrate with me when I get the really good news too. And so I just encourage you to look at your life and see if you have people that will pray for you, that will um, suffer alongside you, that will be there in those trials, but then also you'll have if you have people that will be there in those victories also. Um, we're so blessed to be part of Journey and just um, everything that they've given to us and that's something that we want to continue to do is just multiply and continue to grow um, disciples that are leading other people. Mm -hmm. yeah.